Hey, what is up, everyone? Welcome back to a brand new video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to root any Android device without using a computer, without using any custom recovered like TW or B or anything like that, without unlocking the bootloader of your Android device, without having your device easy and simple. So before the video, I want to ask you if you are not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe and give the notification to get notified about new video. And let's get started. So as I just said, I'm going to be showing you how to get root SS on your Android device step by step. You won't need TWRB to do that. You won't need uh, to unlock the bootloader of your Android device. You won't need anything like that. It's going to be working on any Android device, on any Android, on any Android version. So it doesn't matter the phone you're using. It doesn't matter the version you use. This is going to work on any Android device, on any Android device. Just follow my step. Be careful. And let's get started. First of all, let's start by making change on the device. Open the setting of your Android device. We are going to disable some setting of your Android device. Scroll down to the last option about phone or about device. The last option. Just click on it. We need to the we need to enable the developer option. To do that, we need to find the build number or right over here. The last option build the number. Just click on it around seven times to activate the developer option. Click on build the number around seven times. By doing that, you will unlock the developer option. I have already did that. Just return. Once you have unlocked the developer option, just return. You will find that on setting of your Android device, the developer option. Unlock it. Just click on it to open it up. By doing that, it will open this a uh, window. What you're going to do if your if it is disabled just like mine, just click right over here in the corner right over here in this icon to enable. Click it OK. Click it OK if you ask you. Alright, scroll down. Find this option saying USB the breaking mode. This one over here. We need to enable this as well. Enable the particular one over here in the corner. This icon to enable. Press it OK if it ask you. Don't you worry. Scroll down one more time. Here on window animation skill, you need to disable the animation of the window skill. Put the animation off. Do the same process here on transition disable the animation as well as we did on windows animation put the animation off here on animator duration scale put the same process disable the animation as well scroll down find this option saying force gpu rendering we need to enable this as well click it out over here in the corner to do that to enable all right all right now i'm going to be showing you that i don't have root ss installed on my android device i'm going to be showing you that my android device have no root ss to do that to find that if my phone does to do that to find out if my phone doesn't have root ss to do that to find out if my phone have root ss i'm going to be using this application called the root shaker the link will be available in the description of this video if you want to know as well if your phone have root ss or not install this application doesn't have a virus just to click right over here on shake by doing that the application will start to verify and it's going to tell you automatically if your phone have root ss or not as you can see root ss now installed now rooted that means that my android device have no root ss all right you need to download this file the application that we are going to be using to get root ss on our android device we're going to use this application. The link will be available on the description of this video. This this one over here called the Vimos Pro Premium Mode. This is the latest version of this application. The AP key of Vimos Pro. The link will be available on the description. We need to download this file. It's gonna be zip. Just open it up to extract. Click on honest. By doing that, using this application, this one over here, the link will be available as well on the description of this video. The application that we are going to be using to extract this file is the up clicking on it by doing that it will be opening this option click it right away on extract to replace all right once you have extract the file will be created another folder just like this 
Vamos Pro and they will find the AP key of this application of the Vamos Pro this is installed on your phone I have it already installed you need to worry about it this application doesn't have a virus this is installed on your phone and open it up you need to download one more file the room that we are going to be using to get root access on our android device i'm gonna be giving to you for free a premium room to get root access on your android device i'm gonna be giving you a premium room the link will be available in the description of this video download the room once you have downloaded the file just create another folder and name it as by most project like this just as i did right over here open the folder and create another folder name and pick up and copy the room that you did not just put here on this folder name and pick up as you can see i have already did that this is the file that i'm gonna be giving you in the description of this video the room the premium room now open the application the Vimus pro let's see open the rapid application give you all the permission to the app Give you all your permission to the application to the Vimeo's Pro, you don't need to worry about it. It won't hurt your device. It's 100% safe. Just click right over here. It's room. It's virtual machine. Click on it. By doing that, it will uh, be it will open this window because I'm not connected to on internet. That's why it's open this. But it doesn't work. We don't need internet connection. Just click right over here and this three title right over here in the corner. By doing that, it will open this option, this three option. What you're going to do just click right over here on the first option saying recover ritual machine on the first option, clicking on it. By doing that, it will be a uh, opening this window. What you're going to do just click on it on the room. It will ask you if you really want to do that. Just click right over here on start to recover. By doing that. The, the Vimeo's Pro will start to recover in your file, will start to recover in the room. What you have to do just to be patient and wait, it won't take you too long, just two minutes, one minute, depending on your device. Alright, as you can see, the room has initialized it. It's very cold, very clean. But now let's make some change on this room to make it faster. Go to setting of this room by clicking right over here on the setting icon. As you can see, the Play Store is installed. A uh, exposed is installed. Super soon installed on it. It's very cool. Let's see, go to setting of this room. This room is very stable. You can play a lot of games like PUBG on any kind of game that you want to play. It's very cool. Open the a about emulator device, about emulated device. Find one more time the build number available on the last option. Clicking on it around seven time to unlock the developer option. By doing that, you will unlock the developer option. As you can see, you are now a developer. Just to return, find the developer option on this list. As you can see, it is available right over here. Just click on it on developer option. By doing that, it will open this a window. Scroll down, find the USB DPU mode. This one over here. Make sure to enable it by clicking right over here in the corner. Click OK if you ask you. Scroll down. Find the window animation skill. The window animation skill it is disabled off as well. It's pretty cool. Find the first GPU rendering. Enable this option as well. Alright. It's very cool. Very simple. And very fast. Alright, now I'm gonna be showing you if this have root access to do that. I'm going to be using this application, the root shaker, which is already installed on this room. Just click on the root shaker to find out if this have root access or not. And when the application is going to be just like this, what you're going to do just click right over here on a verify root. As you can see, congratulations, root access is properly installed on this device. 
easy and simple without using a computer, without hiring a math device, without using any custom recovery like TWRB, without unlocking the bootloader of my Android device. Uh, export it installed, installed it on it as well, working perfectly without using a computer, without a uh, using none of that. Okay, guys, I will start from here. This video help you out. If this video help you out, of course, please leave a like, subscribe to my channel, leave a notification to get notified about new video. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out.